Hi there, Collective. I'm back with another reading. Your energy cannot be duplicated. That's what Spirit is saying. Your energy cannot be duplicated. You're one in a million. You're one in a billion. There's no carbon copies of you. God, Jesus, and the Holy Spirit, please come in and use me as the vessel. I ask for you to bless my throat chakra to speak my truth. Ask all the archangels and the angels, my ancestors, and my past over loved ones, and anybody I met along the way, to come in for guidance, for clarity, for discernment. Give me the eyes to see and the ears to hear. Butterfly and snowdrop, hope. Have hope. You can have hope and faith the size of a mustard seed, and God will always protect you. The turtle and coriander, satisfaction. You're getting your satisfaction. You're whole and complete. You're satisfied with exactly who you are at this moment in time. You realize you're on the right path. You've always been on the right path. And many have come up against you to take you off your path. But they have failed. They have failed. The moth and the eucalyptus. An ending. Expect an ending. They can't get to you anymore. Everything they send to you is returned returned or transmuted you use all that hate you take it on you know why they're doing it it's because they're jealous they're envious let it go turn it into love use their energy the negative and use it for good anybody that's ever taken any anger management courses should know what this means anybody who's dealing with their sobriety knows what this means don't allow people to control you. You're done. They're done. That's what spirit keeps saying. You're done. Don't worry about it. Keep going with the flow. Anything else, spirit? Haha, ha, the hound and the pair. It's loyalty. Your ancestors are loyal to you. You are loyal to them, you're loyal to God, you're loyal to Jesus, and they know it. They see you. They watch over you. Spirit just said, if you haven't got a picture of Jesus or, or God in you, in your house or in your mind, you're being encouraged to get one. Know that when you ask for forgiveness, you are forgiven. It's that simple. People of your past may try to bring you back down, but that's where they want to keep you, in your past, wallowing, crying, separated, full of shame. That's not what God and Jesus want for you. You have a better future ahead of you, so walk away from the past. Let it go. The mouse and the buttercup, innocence. You are returning to innocence, your childlike state. Like God intended. He sent you here for a reason. And they tried to destroy you. They can't destroy you. They can't destroy God. The power of God is mighty. He's given you many, many warnings. Many warnings. He's given many warnings. So the quail and the gooseberry. The anticipation the excitement that's rising up inside of you because your justice is being served, right? The truth is coming out. The truth of everything. The bee and pomegranate, it's productivity. You've been very productive. You've been very faithful. Your prayers haven't changed. Not since the day you were born. Your prayers have always remained the same. 
you know what you're here to do so you need to do it if you haven't started you're being encouraged to start today the porcupine and enemy as boundaries you have a right to have boundaries nobody has any right to infiltrate your energy put on the armor of god the lizard and pitcher plant the energy harvesting that they've been trying to do to you is causing the stagnation so now that you know where the energy is coming from and why you're feeling this way you're able to take your power back cut the cords and move forward. Pay attention to nature. Nature holds everything you need for survival, for healing. You're being encouraged to pay attention. The Martin and the Foxglove, the mischief, the mischief, the mischief is all being exposed. So no, whatever is done in the dark is brought to the light. The beaver and the birch is home. You could be working on your home. Your home is your sanctuary. You are safe. You are protected. You have a firm foundation. The owl and the hop is wisdom. The wisdom you're gaining is out of this world. Just keep your faith collective. God will never send us anywhere where it will cause us danger or harm. The wolf and the rose hip, it's guardianship. You are protected. You are protected, 100%. It's been coming up a lot. Some people hear the message and some people don't. This is for people who are not hearing the messages. You are protected. God hears all your prayers. Let them try to come against you. God will stop them dead in their tracks. Dead in their tracks. The spider and passion flower. Creative ingenu ingenuity. You're very creative. You're very, very creative. And your ingenuity is out of this world as well. You just know when to go and know when not to. Because you listen to your intuition. Yes. Yes, the ram and Delia determination. Your determination is what propels you. God gives you everything you need to succeed. When you call him in, you will have the power of a thousand lions and you can move mountains. When you change, the world around you changes. It's inevitable. You're just on a different energy frequency. Vulture and at asphodel, it's upheaval. That's pretty self descriptive. You're receiving your justice collective. Don't take other people's burdens on, don't involve yourself in other people's karma. All you can do is pray for them, they have to make the initial step. The boar and the pumpkin is confidence. Your confidence is building higher and higher. Don't let them steal that from you, collective. Put on the armor of God. These energy harvesters are done because they don't know what they're tapping into and it's gonna fry their brain. They're just not evolved. They're using old school tactics. The old doesn't work anymore because you're protected Call back your power, cut the cords, and your soul retrieval. You've done all this, so now you know your truth. They can't get anything from you. They'll just short circuit. So remember to ground yourself. Empaths especially, you're highly sensitive. Connect with nature. And the crumbling. The crumbling. We know what this means. So what are you clinging on to? It's time to let go. Where we're going, 
where they're going. All their accumulated stuff they can't take with them. You can't take it with you. The world has many portals on it. The truth is coming out. The truth is coming out. That's all I keep hearing. The truth is coming out. You're a pillar of light. Your vibration is rising. You are the oracle. You are. God sends messages to you all the time. This is what you were born for. You're waking people up, bringing them to the light. At least, if anything, you're opening up their minds. People are seeing the truth. Anything else here? Okay. This is the final card. You are surrounded by the Council of Light. You are totally protected. Divine orchestration and helpers in subtle realms. So know that your soul family is definitely with you. Everybody's watching over you. They're guiding you. They're giving you the knowledge. They're showing you how to remain calm, peaceful. You're gaining more wisdom. You're using your inner light, your inner power source. Thank you, Collective. Have a wonderful day. I'll see you tomorrow on my next upload. God bless. Take care. And I love you.